Taylor exposed. Travis Kelsey finally exposed Taylor Swift's secret hiding schemes from suitcases to cleaning carts. Liverpool is about to be swept up in the fervor of Taylor Swift's upcoming concert tour. The city, known for its passionate Liverpool FC fan base, is bracing for a different kind of crowd as the pop superstars AAS tour lands at Anfield Stadium. Swifties, as the singer's loyal fans are known, are expected to flood the streets, and local businesses couldn't be more excited. The Sandon, a pub with over a century of history catering to the soccer crowd, is gearing up for a transformation. Floor manager Siri Smith reveals that the pub will soon be filled with Swift fans ready to party and sing along to their favorite hits. It's mainly girls wanting to dress up and bachelorette parties wanting to go to the concerts, she tells CNN. The Sandon is pulling out all the stops, hiring a Taylor Swift lookalike for karaoke and setting up a glitter face paint station, creating a true Swifty paradise. The excitement isn't confined to just the pub, local businesses across the city are expecting a massive boost in revenue. From bakeries to fish and chip shops, everyone is preparing for the Swift effect. Liverpool One, a sprawling complex of stores, bars, restaurants, and hotels, is forecasting an influx of 100,000 additional visitors, translating to a whopping 12 million pounds in extra spending. This phenomenon is not new. Taylor Swift's concerts are known to have a significant economic impact on the cities she visits. In the U.S., restaurants within a 2.5-mile radius of her concerts saw sales soar by over 68%, with accommodation spending up by 32%. Liverpool, one of the UK's most deprived cities, stands to gain significantly from this influx of visitors. To welcome Taylor Swift, local officials have partnered with artists to create a Taylor Town Trail, featuring 11 art installations around the city, each representing one of her musical eras. Highlights include a glittering grand piano for the Evermore era and giant hearts for the Lover era. The University of Liverpool is also hosting Tay Day, a conference dedicated to discussing the pop star's impact. Swift's fans have played a crucial role in her success, and the singer recognizes their importance. In a quote, she expresses her gratitude for the fans who have empowered her, choosing her version of the story over others. She aims to make them as happy as they have made her, emphasizing the mutual appreciation between the artist and her devoted fan base. The excitement surrounding Swift's visit evokes memories of Beatlemania, when the Beatles' fame transformed Liverpool into a global music hub. As Harry Doyle of Liverpool City Council notes, Swift has a huge following, just like the iconic Liverpool band. While modern security measures prevent a 1960s-style airport greeting, the city is palpably excited to welcome the pop sensation with open arms and glittering faces. Taylor Swift's Sneaky Suitcase Shenanigans Beneath the surface of Taylor Swift's glittering stardom lies a master of disguise, using creative tactics to avoid the relentless paparazzi and devoted fans. Swifties have pieced together some of her most bizarre methods, and even her close friend Zayn Malik has spilled juicy details about the singer's extreme measures to maintain her privacy. During the 2016 feud with Kim Kardashian and Kanye West, Taylor practically vanished, hinting at the chaos in her album reputation. Rumors began to swirl that she had resorted to hiding in a suitcase to evade the paparazzi, and Zayn Malik confirmed the suspicions, casually mentioning that Taylor was traveling around in a suitcase. Taylor's commitment to staying under the radar persisted in later years. In 2019, reports suggested that she and her then-boyfriend Joe Alwyn went incognito in New York, donning outrageous disguises of bright pink wigs and scarves. While this theory was debunked, it showcased Taylor's playful game of hide-and-seek with the public.